My name is James. I work here at Robertson Heating Supply in the engineering department. Today we're going to be testing the direct spark ignition of a ring furnace. The only tools you need are going to be a length of 12 gauge wire, insulated needle nose pliers, and perhaps other various hand tools. Let's get started. To begin, firstly ensure that the unit is powered off before beginning. Visually inspect the igniter wire to make sure it's not pinched, crimped, crushed, or otherwise compromised in any way. After that, you'll want to attach a 12 gauge wire to a grounded screw somewhere in the furnace. After that, you'll want to that you'll want to remove the igniter wire from the terminal. Once that's completed, restore power to the furnace and initiate a call for heat. Hold the 12 gauge wire with a pair of insulated pliers approximately one quarter of an inch away from the ignition terminal you should see the voltage arc from the terminal to ground. If it does, and there are no obvious issues with the ignition wire, ensure the burners are grounded. Thank you for watching my video. If you like it, please like, comment, and subscribe for more videos from Robertson Heating Supply. This is part of an ongoing series of technical videos, so please be sure to check out the other ones. If you have any comments, questions, or concerns, please feel to comment below or reach out to us here at Robertson Heating Supply at 330-821-9180 and you can ask for the engineering department. Again, my name is James. Thank you so much.